I need to figure out where to put my phone when I'm vlogging in the car. Maybe, maybe there. No, maybe not. <laughs> Hey guys, my name is Shasta Garcia. I'm the host of Shasta's Journey and one of my little sisters, Holly, right there, and I decided to take a 21 day break from Instagram. And this video is a collection of videos of my experience being away from Instagram and how my perspective has changed and my difficulties and my wants and needs and desires. I'm dog sitting right now. <laughs> She's going a little crazy. She really likes the turtle. Anyways, so take a look and see how this 21 day journey. Enjoy. 3.28 a.m. It's only been two minutes. <laughs> I'm so sad. Like, I just posted a photo that I was, like, you know, taking a break from Instagram and I just want to, like, refresh and see how many likes I've gotten so far. Probably none. The next day. Mm, so it's the morning after. <laughs> or, well, this all happened at like 3 a.m. in the morning. But, um, we told oh, our parents. Oh my god, you look at the crap. <laughs> I do. Or I do. Um, we told our parents. They don't believe us. They don't think that we're capable. We're capable. We're very capable. <laughs> cool. Every part of us wants to go on social media, babe. <laughs> Day three. I actually had a photographer send me some photos that he had taken from the past and I was like, oh my gosh, these would be such cute photos to post on Instagram. And then I was like, oh, I'm gonna have to wait a month or 21 days to post it. So, I don't know. It's like, I just need to find a balance for when I go back on Instagram of what I should be posting and what I shouldn't. I think I just need to show some more real content. Day four. Do my how nasty I look. I look gross. <laughs> Me too. But I don't gotta look cute. Our problem is, is when we post a picture, we want reaction. So we want likes and things. So that's the main problem. But going on and scrolling, I mean, that's a problem for me at least. I mean, I, I can just not go on it. Uh. I might be wearing a little too much yellow today. I, this is so awkward recording myself. Anywho, um, I think I forgot to record yesterday. So I'm still letting you know that it still sucks not being able to express what I'm going through throughout my day. I kind of miss minting to you guys. An hour later. Okay guys, so I'm not driving. I finally found a place to put my phone in my car. But I... This is not, this is not an update on social media, but more of like a life college revelation. You do a lot of sitting, a lot of sitting. You go from sitting in a classroom to sitting in a coffee shop or sitting in a cafeteria or sitting in your car. Sitting, sitting. The only exercising that I do is walk to my car. Yay, hey, get that. Two hours later. All right, I understand this is my third vlog of today, but this is like my way of communicating what I'm feeling because I don't have Instagram, okay? But, ah. Uh, March is endometriosis awareness month and the doctors think I have endometriosis and that explains some of the pain I've been through, right? But anyways, um, I just realized that I'm not going to be able to post for the month of March anything. And if I had Instagram, I would. So that's another like bonus of Instagram. <laughs> the next day once again i am not driving i um just got to my car after a really really long day i've been up since 3 30 in the morning but i wanted to give you guys a quick update i don't know what day i'm on um i'm doing really really good like i there's a few things like i said with networking is really hard i do have experiences and things that i do want to share with you guys and there's just so many things that god is doing in my life and i really like to use my social media to share that because I think that's just a, such an awesome platform to share God's goodness and I really do miss that so um uh when I get back on Instagram I really just want to really want to focus on that but I want to show the good and the bad I think that's really where I need to start working on and focus less on the followers and likes because you know what you are not determined by the followers and likes that you have no several days later okay so I have not done a lot of vlogs with my makeup on so before I take off my makeup I just wanted to do a quick vlog 
Um, I do have to talk quiet because it's later and I'm trying not to wake anybody up. But I'm doing really, really good without social media. It is difficult networking with people because they'll be like, add me on Instagram. And I'm like, sorry, I'm taking a break from Instagram. So I say networking is probably the worst part right now. But um, otherwise, I feel really great being on social media. But I'm looking forward to being back. Three days later. All right, so I clearly have been sucking at... <laughs> these daily vlogs. I'm so sorry. Anyways, I don't really notice Instagram that much other than when it comes to networking or when God is doing something amazing in my life or if I need prayer or something and I don't have that connectiveness that I normally do with social media. So I think that's kind of where I stand at the moment. Um, when you'll be seeing this, I will have access to my Instagram again, which is awesome. Um, I'm excited to see how I can use my social media platforms differently. The next day. When you're not on Instagram, you gotta find things that entertain you. Like sleep. And massage your sister's head. Next morning another day with no makeup and my hair up and I'm wearing the same shirt from yesterday <laughs> yeah and uh, no Instagram so <laughs> my life that's my life drinking this um, zero calorie water with caffeine don't really know how that works but whatever it's good so life's going great without social media I don't know why I'm looking at me instead of the camera but hello you can up a chain nice <laughs> Life is good. Life is real good. <clears throat> 15 minutes later. Honestly, life is not that bad without Instagram. I just listen to a lot more worship music. And read a lot more of my Bible. And I'm a little bit more productive in school. <laughs> I suggest everybody does it. Even just for a little bit. Like, it doesn't have to be for a long time. Confession. I put on this jacket so it looked like I had a different outfit on. But really, I just wore... The same shirt that I wore yesterday. Today. The following day. Anyways, I'm sitting at a Starbucks. This is really awkward for me to record, but I am missing out on venting on social media. I think that's what I miss the most is being able to like share what I'm experiencing on social media. I never realized how much I actually really appreciated that. One week later. All right. So it's been a while since I have vlogged. So sorry, guys. But I'm doing fine. I realized that though for like my jobs like I have to go on social media which is it kind of defeats my whole like detox thing but oh well the point is for me to be less concerned about the followers and likes that I get so I think I'm making progress days later so we are at the Kaser 3 studio and I have one more day left of this 21 day fast from Instagram so um, it's tough because they're all on Instagram and I'm not so. I'm just crashing this. <laughs> <laughs> we have to get out of their studio. I guess to be on Instagram. So the next morning. Guys, it's day 21. That means tomorrow I get my Instagram back again. And honestly, like, I've, I've been enjoying being away from Instagram, but I'm so excited to go back. Like, I have new content. I know what I want to do now with my social media. And it was so nice to have a break. So, Holly's in the background. Yeah. So be on the lookout for some more real content, more about Jesus, and just me embracing me and being real. So hope you guys got something from this video. If you need to do a three-week fast, do it. Do it. It's hard, but do it. Do it. Thank you. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I post once a week. I don't really have a set day, so just really any day. So just turn on the post notifications, the little bell, so you can be notified when I post. And also go follow Holly. And you can follow us on our Instagrams now that we are back. Yes. Yay. And then right here. Right here, guys, go ahead and follow. I'm going to have real content from here on me out. Me too. You're going to see the stupid side of me. So Yes, so the silly, the funny, more faith, and just being real, guys. So I hope you enjoyed that and hope it was lightning. It has inspired you guys to take a break away from social media every once in a while and to figure out how you can use your platform for the better and to impact others. 
Bye guys. Adios. Stop, Paul. You're not helping my I'm habit. Not this. <laughs> Finally. All right. Um, oh, I forgot you can't record in vertical. Every part of me.